Volvo was challenged by the Department of Energy to build a truck that was 100% more efficient than others on the road. Back with a 134% more efficient truck. In 2016, the U.S. Department of Energy challenged Volvo trucks to design a tractor trailer that is 100% more efficient than a basic equivalent vehicle. Today, the automaker announced that it not only met that goal, but exceeded it. The automaker claims that, thanks to aerodynamic and material improvements, the Super Truck 2 is 134% more efficient than the equivalent 2009 tractor trailer it chose as its basis. Partnering with the DOE for the Super Truck program presents an exciting opportunity to push the boundaries of technology to see what is technically possible in heavy duty transportation, said Peter Vurhoev, president of Volvo Trucks North America. We are extremely proud of the accomplishments of our advanced engineering team working on Super Truck 2. Volvo says most of the efficiency gains made by the Super Truck 2 come from its improved aerodynamics. The cabin is described as having perfect wedge shapes, with a wraparound windshield. In addition, the trailer's fairings and boat tail help the automaker create 50% less drag than its base truck from 2009. However, the way it blocks the wind is not the only reason it is more efficient. Volvo also made the truck lighter by using things like composite driva shafts and reducing the number of axles compared to other American trucks. The cabinet is also shorter than the others, which means less materials had to be used in its construction. Volvo also thought about the project truly holistically. In addition to being more efficient on the road, Super Truck 2 also has a 48-volt mild hybrid system that acts as a generator with an integrated starter motor. This allows drivers to operate all comfort features without having to idle the engine for long periods of time. Although this was designed purely as a concept, Volvo says the lessons learned during the development process have already been transferred to production trucks. He also says he wants the efficiency gains of this project to be tested in the real world, not just in the wind tunnel. The project team deliberately focused on driving in real-world conditions for testing, Vurhoev said. The data was not collected solely in the laboratory or on flat empty roads with ideal conditions and light loads. Instead, our Super Truck 2 was tested in real-world scenarios with a GCVW of 65,000 pounds on roads with traffic and elevation changes. Volvo plans to show the Super Truck 2 to the public for the first time at the American Trucking Association's 2023 Executive Conference and Expo, taking place October 14-17 in Austin, Texas. Besides the Super Truck 2, it also plans to show off the all-electric VNR Electric 6x2 day cab tractor, which has a range of 275 miles (442 kilometers) thanks to a 565 kilowatt-hour battery. The electric motor can also produce 455 horsepower (339 kW/461 PS) and 4,051 lb-ft. 5,492 newton meters of torque.